Army National Guard bands act as musical ambassadors for the United States, the Army, and their state. Their mission includes military ceremonies, soldier and veteran support, and acting as the public face of the Army and the military service. Bands bring the soldier and the citizen together as one community, engendering patriotism, pride, and support for the purpose and mission of the United States military. No better organization exists to further this mission than the Guard Band. Through the power of music, bands stir pride in the heart of the American soldier and the citizens they are sworn to protect. Guard Bands are uniquely positioned for their purpose. They live in the communities they serve, working as full-time civilians, yet coming together to perform their unique Army mission. And this is something Army National Guard Bands have been doing for a long time. These bands share important characteristics that distinguish them from their active component counterparts. Characteristics that require distinct understanding, qualifications, and standards for soldiers. The successful guard band soldier must be able to do many things beyond playing their instrument. Mission success necessitates soldiers with diverse skills and abilities, many of which go unseen but are essential to the mission. We play alongside and in essence compete with full-time private sector bands for missions or what we call gigs in the music world. These days, people have a hundred different things competing for their attention, and, like it or not, our product is compared with every other entertainment option out there. We want to keep the soldier and their sacrifice in the hearts and minds of the community, so we end up spending a great deal of time on things that aren't playing or practicing. It doesn't matter how good of a player we are if nobody is there to hear it because the website and promotion was inadequate or the sound reinforcement in the venue is lousy. Whether it's booking venues, promoting mission to the public, stage production, video production, sound reinforcement, musical arrangement, the Army doesn't train us to do these things, and we certainly aren't evaluated on them. But they are essential to the success in a unit whose mission is, to a large degree, public engagement. The versatility of today's guard bandsmen is invaluable to mission success, but admittedly difficult to assess externally without focusing instead on the impact of the mission. Malls, job fairs, schools, recruiters can partner with bands to reach audiences that are younger and more receptive to military service and the mission of the National Guard. Bands can create a bridge that helps young people see that not only are soldiers regular citizens whom they can relate to, but that the Guard is a great choice for their future. Guard band soldiers bring considerable value to the Army and the mission of Army bands. The training opportunities available to these soldiers are dwarfed by the number of successful missions they perform. The commitment that they have to the mission causes them to give considerable amount of personal time investing in mission success. This is time the taxpayer isn't paying for. But our soldiers and veterans deserve to have the most professional representation possible, so they do it. They spend our time and effort on what will create the most impact for our mission, regardless of whether they're individually assessed on it or on a paid status. The ability of an army band to lift the spirits of soldiers and the stature of these soldiers' mission is too often understated. Whether it's playing for the departure of a deployed unit or their successful and triumphant return, music honors the unit, their families, and the mission. Bands have the ability to take on the characteristics of the unit they are supporting. They can play the unit song or even sing it. They represent the commanding general to the soldiers and are a tangible show of love and support to every member of the unit the band is supporting. The band is a potent tool for the National Guard as they seek to build partnerships with other government agencies and even foreign governments. Locally, the bands act in a ceremonial capacity for their state government as a tool for fostering productive relationships for the states. 
Guard bands can also be used to develop ties with state agencies like police and highway administrations, who incidentally employ many guardsmen, and who have more potential soldiers in their ranks. The possibilities are limitless. Internationally, the National Guard Band can be a powerful instrument when developing relationships with foreign governments, endearing their leaders and citizens to the United States and our interests with the power of music. I can't tell you the number of veterans, soldiers, and community members that have come to me after a concert or an appearance, just like I'm a family member. And in a way I am. I have the privilege and responsibility to represent their soldier, their grandfather, their brother, their neighbor, their friend. There's a growing divide in this country between the military and civilian world. Just 1% of this country has served in the armed forces, but we're both. We're citizens and soldiers. And we have the unique ability through our mission to bridge that divide and encourage support and respect for the military service. And civilians can relate to us, you know, we don't live the military life. We live just as they do. The best way to assess my effectiveness and the effectiveness of my unit is by looking at the mission. If the mission is successful, it's because the soldier is successful. So we ask ourselves, do we produce a professional product worthy of the army and our fellow soldiers? Are we representing the military to our fellow citizens in a manner that fosters appreciation and respect for service members? Do we carry forward the military music tradition in a manner worthy of the uniform? Do we affect hearts and minds in a way that strengthens the army and the nation? The capabilities and effectiveness of the Army National Guard bandsmen must be assessed in light of their mission, a distinctly different mission than that of their active component brethren. These soldiers deserve an assessment system that defines their success in light of that mission and accounts for their versatility, efficiency, teamwork, and professionalism. Band commanders must be empowered to evaluate their soldiers and develop their bands in a manner that reflects the distinct mission of guard bands and the qualities that that mission requires.